it says the radius of a circle is increasing at the rate of 3 cm per second. Find the rate of change of the area when r is equal to 4 cm. So the area of a circle, we know the formula to be a is equal to pi r squared. If we differentiate that, we get dA with respect to r, so dA dr. And that will just give me, bring that 2 down in front, we're going to get 2 pi, is just a constant, so we'll leave it as it is, 2 pi r. This is called the rate of change of the area with respect to the radius. We're required to find dA dt, the rate of change of area, so the rate of change of the area with time t. So dA dt will be equal to dA by dr, because we've got that. Now, using the chain rule, if we want to get this to be equal to dA by dt, then here we're going to have to write a dr dt. So you can think of the drs like cancelling out, though that's strictly not true. So we can see that that's equal using the chain rule. Now we know from the question that dr dt is equal to 3 centimetres Three centimeters per second from the question we've got that here the radius is increasing so it's the rate of change of the radius so that's going to be 2 pi r because dA by dr is 2 pi r times the 3 so it's going to give 6 pi r so what we've got that dA dt is 6 pi r so that's a differential equation which gives me the rate of change over time now, if we know the radius is 4, we can say that the a by dt is going to be 6 pi times 4. That's going to give me the answer is 24 pi centimeter squared, area centimeter squared per second. The rate of change of 24 pi centimeter squared per second. And you really should use lead pi in your final answer. Okay, so this has been a video on how to so that you can relate one change to another change. I hope you've understood and I thank you very much for watching.